Hello guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, we will discuss about the 50 unit of DSSM subject that is optimization. In optimization, we will discuss the important topics are which are came in the examination point of view most times that are the first one is unconstrained optimization which will be using maximum minimum method by to solve this concept problems. The second one is gradient descent method and the third one is constraint optimization which is using by graphical method or simplex method. Most of use graphical method when there is objective function and constant or in linear type then we use graphical method when the object function is more than linear type and constant or uh, linear type and also more degree polynomials we use simplex method the fourth one is this is the most and most important topics that is kkt conditions this is the most important topic which gives most times in unit 5 in the examination point of view the fifth one is also most important topics that is least square optimization the sixth one is linear regression algorithms in linear regression algorithms the first topic which gives is least con square optimization and second topic is super intercept concept in, in linear regression algorithms only we have this topic and this topics this is the most used topic and this also most user topic only that is slope and intercept coming to the first concept that is unconstrained optimization that is maximum minimum method definition is it refers to the process of finding the maximum and minima of mathematical function that is here give that the function fu mathematical function that is f of x in which we find the maximum and minima value without any constraint in maximum minima method we, we, we does not consist of any constraints does not contain any constraint we only get, have the objective function in the in this method so here without any constraint in the value of the variable involved in objective function this whole definition means that in maximum minima method we have only objective function f of x it does not consist of any constraints this is the meaning of this definition the necessary and sufficient conditions in maximum minima method is first we have to know about the hessian matrix in, in this concept necessary and sufficient conditions in hessian matrix the definition is it is a second order partial derivation that is dou square f by dou, dou x square dou square f by dou y square this or means the second order partial derivatives which depends upon number of decision variables that is here decision variables means x y z a comma b comma c these are the decision variables it is a square matrix that is either 2 by 2 or 3 by 3 or 4 by 4 it the Hessian matrix will be in 2 by 2 3 by 3 or 4 by 4 and on so on matrices form it is denoted by capital H letter the elements in Hessian matrix are to be row wise ordered for corresponding decision variables the whole definition means that the Hessian matrix is the uh, this form of partial derivative does it, that is second order partial derivatives which depends on the x comma y comma z decision variables and it is a square matrix and denoted by h it is the row wise order corresponding decision variables it is the form uh, the condition and the matrix form for hessian matrix for 2 by 2 matrix is dou square f by dou x square dou square f by dou x y dou into dou, y, dou x into dou y and dou y square dou square f by dou y into dou x and dou square f by dou y square it is for 2 by 2 matrix it is by using this we find a hessian matrix for 3 by 3 it will be like this that is dou square f by dou x square dou square f by dou x dou y dou square f by dou x dou z dou square f by dou y dou x dou square f by dou y square dou square f by dou y dou z 
एंड डो स्केर एफ बाई डो एक्स डो जेड डो स्केर एफ बाई डो जेड डो वाई डो स्केर एफ बाई डो जेड स्क्वेयर इट इज फॉर थ्री बाई थ्री मैट्रिक्स आफ्टर फाइंडिंग द प्रिंसिपल फाइंडिंग द हिशियन मैट्रिक्स वी हैव द सेकेंड स्टेप इज टू फाइंड द प्रिंसिपल माइनर्स फॉर द टू बाई टू मैट्रिक्स वी हैव प्रिंसिपल माइनर्स इज मॉड H1 वन इक्वल्स टू डो स्क्र एफ बाई डो स्क्वेयर दिस इज द पोजिशन ऑफ दिस डो स्क्र एफ बाई डो स्क्र दट इज ए वन वन हियर दिस इज इंडिकेटेड एज ए वन वन ए वन टू ए टू वन एंड ए टू टू लाइक दिस ओनली हियर वी राइट द पोजिशन ऑफ दिस दट इज डो स्क्र एफ बाई डो स्क्र एस द वैल्यू ऑफ दिस दिस डेरीवेशन दट इज द मॉड हेच वन वैल्यू of principal manner 1 for 2 by 2 matrix we find the two principal manner that is mod h1 and mod h2 so finding the mod h2 principal that is equals to we have to do the ad minus bc by doing ad minus this into this into this we get the mod h2 value for 3 by 3 matrix same for 2 by 2 the 3 by 3 also is there it will be added h mod h3 principal minor that is here mod h1 equals to same this one and mod h2 equal to same ad minus bc and for mod h3 we have to do a of ea minus fh fh minus b of da minus fg plus c of dh minus eg to finding the debt this is means the debt value of the matrix debt value you have to do the debt to find the mod h3 principal minor the third step is finding sufficient conditions yet the sufficient condition for the maximum minimum method concept for the problem how to find the is their problem is in maxima or minima or nor neither maxima or neither minima these are the main conditions we have to know about this condition in extreme point if matrix of second order partial derivative that means these all are second order partial derivative means these are all here the principal minor h1 comma h2 or both values are positive that is that means it is minima relative and both h1 h2 principal minors are negative we we have to say that it is maxima relative if they are alternate sign it will be saddle point there is no maxima or no minima it will be value is zero that we say zero and nothing but if if value is if value is less than if value is greater than 0 it will be minima relative that will be positive if value is less than 0 it will be negative that is maxima relative if it is equals to 0 equal to 0 means it will equals to 0 means saddle point let us understand this all this all concept that is hessian matrix and principal minors and sufficient conditions by doing one problem one example problem let us do an example problem here given question that maximize or maximize or minimize the function f of x comma y equals to x square plus y square plus x plus y minus 1 let us start the problem given that f of x function equals to a square plus y square plus x plus y minus 1 here first of all we have to do that do that do x by do y we have to differentiate do f by do x here we have to differentiate the, the function with x that is do f by do x we get Do the d by d x of d by d x of x square plus d by d x of y square plus d by d x of x plus d by d x of y minus d by d x of one. Here, do f by do x equals to it is in the form of exponent formula. That it means n into x power n minus one. In the place of n, here have two. That is two into x power two minus one. We get two x two x two x power one. That is in the place of this, we get two x 
when here asking to differentiate with x it is here y variable so d by dx of y square we get 0 that is plus 0 plus d by dx of x is x x cancel we get 1 like here is different variable we get here 0 and d by dx of constant is 0 so here d, d f by dx equals to we get 2x plus 1 value now we have to differentiate dou f by dou y we have to differentiate this function with d, dou y that is d by dy of x square plus d by dy of y square plus d by dy of x plus d by dy of y minus d by d, dy of 1 we get dou f by dou y by using same exponent here d by dy of x square here variable is different we have to differentiate only to y variables only so this is zero value and it is in the form of x power n we get same logic formula substituting like this we get dou by dou, dou y of y square that is 2y and dou by dou y of x is 0 here dou by dou y is value is 1 and d by d, d by dy of 1 is 0 so dou f by dou y equals to value is 2y plus 1 here here we have here dou f by dou y equals to 0 that is dou, dou y dou f by dou dou f by dou x value is what 2x plus 1 equals equals to 0 here 2x equals to minus 1 and x equals to minus 1 by 2 that is we get the x value is minus 1 by 2 here now dou f by dou y equals to 0 here dou f by dou y value is what 2y plus 1 equals to 0 so 2y equals to minus 1 and y equals to minus 1 by 2 this is y now we have to find the hessian matrix that is capital H equals to dou square of by dou x square dou square of by dou x dou y dou square of by dou y dou x dou square of by dou y square equals to 0 here we didn't know that dou square of by dou x square value and these are all we didn't know so first of all find out the these four values here we know that the dou f by dou f by dou x value to find the dou square f by dou, dou square f by dou x square value we have to differentiate again the that is dou f by dou x with dou f by dou x that is for getting this we have to do this that is dou by dou x into dou f by dou x here dou by dou x the dou f by dou x value is what 2x plus 1 that is dou f by dou do f do by do x of 2x is what here x is cancel we get 2 do by do x of constant value is 0 so do square of by do do x square value is 2 now here we have to find do square of by do y square for finding do square of by do y square we have to do do by do y into do f by do y that means here dou by dou y dou by dou y of dou f by dou y value is this one 2y plus 1 by doing this dou by dou y of 2y here y y cancel we get 2 and dou by dou y of constant value is 0 so we get dou square f by dou y square value is equals to 0 equals to 2 sorry equals to 2 here for finding the dou square f by dou x dou x into dou y the value is always 0 because in this we, here we have 2x plus 1 here is x value is there if we derivate with y here is different variable so it will get 0 and same as here also we well variable is different when we 
differentiate with x it will get 0 so here h equals to this dou square of by dou x square value is 2 this value is 0 and this value is 0 and dou square of by dou y square value is 2 equals to 0 here we out, here, here it is into 2 by 2 matrix for 2 by 2 matrix the principal minors are mod h1 and mod h2 that is for mod h1 is dou square of by dou y square value that is 2 that is here 2 it means it is greater than 0 and mod h2 means ad minus bc ad means 2 into 2 minus bc means 0 into 0 we get 2 into 2 is 4 minus 0 that is we get 4 that is greater than 0 here here we see that here h1 is positive and h2 also positive when h1 and h2 both are positive the given fun f of x function is maximum function is minimum that is greater than 0 so it is the minimized function we get this function is minimize minimum relative or minimize because the h1 h2 principal minus are greater than 0 and positive so the given function x square plus y square plus x plus y minus 1 is minimized relative or minimized function hope you love the video guys like share comment and subscribe and click the bell icon to be notified every update from my small studies youtube channel thank you guys hello guys welcome to my youtube channel hope you people like the video keep supporting me by subscribing the youtube channel and like share comment and click the bell icon to be notified every update from my small studies youtube channel thank you guys